Good morning, everybody. Today, we are going to make hairy, scary, one-eyed monsters. Our colors for today are all of them. You can see I have this cup of encased cane. So I'm going to pick out some bright and happy rainbow colors. And that's what we're going to make our monster out of. I also have just a little cane left here, just red and white. I'm going to use that to make his legs. And then, of course, black and white for his eyes. So let's go. Okay, here we go. Um, I am starting out with a barrel. It is a seven across by two high. And even though I'm going to use my barrel, my crunch, crunch to make the base, I'm going to use the same procedures that I do on my lentil beads. And that is get that barrel hot and then roll it because we're shooting for a concentric amount of glass around the center of the mandrel. So I use that rolling method with pretty much anything that I press. I just get such a nice bead out of the press. So that looks pretty concentric. The holes are puckered. I'm heating it up. And now a gentle press in my press. And there we go. Nice. A nice little rectangle footprint to start with. I'm gonna go ahead and torch out the tool marks. That looks good. It doesn't look like I have to square up any sides too much. And on the speed, it doesn't really matter. You can have some little round edges if you like. But I do like to just get the tool marks out. Okay, first thing that goes on is his legs. Because the legs, for me, on this bead, are my white reference point. So I got my stringer. I should probably heat it up a little bit. And just on each side of that mandrel, let's go ahead and roll down some legs just like so <laughs> he got striped socks on he's got striped socks on and now i'm going to just press down those little legs just like that and now let's start making them hairy <laughs> i usually start out with my longest stringer just to put in the outline so we'll put in, let's see, he's going to have a lot of hair. And here we go. Just start filling in the hair. I start with kind of a U or a backward C um, around the edges. And then I just start striping. So let's put some red here. Now one thing when you're working with that transparent base, I think I got, um, it's a Fetre like streaky gray or something like that. Keep the back cool because I always get cracks right along the back end of the mandrel. In fact, it looks like I already got one. Huh, that's weird. I already got a crack. Yay, lovely. Okay, so make sure that you really keep that back part cool. Also, the corners for me tend to crack when I'm using this transparent glass as a base. Kind of annoying. Okay, we're going to put down some hair. I got this yellow. And then I'm going to heat the back. <laughs> and then, oh, that was orange. Okay, now I got my yellow. Let's put down some hair. And I'm just filling in all the little spots here. Fill them in, heat the back, <laughs> fill it in, heat the back, grab another color, heat the corners. God, I am such a procedure freak. Some habits are hard to break, I guess. There we go, there's some green, just kind of filling in, heat the back, <laughs> fill in. I got my blue and I am um, on these stringers I of course I don't know I woke up with a color issue so whenever I I can't figure out what colors to use 
I go to the rainbow. There's some blues. This guy's going to be hairy. And finally, some little purple. I probably covered up all the red and orange on the bottom, but that's okay. All right. Now let's go ahead and smash that stuff down, especially the stuff on the edges here. Maybe a little smash down on the top. Just secure those stringers. And because they're that encased cane, um, they're gonna kind of stay separated. The hairs will stay separated. They don't melt together. So while I am heating up my white eyeball glass, I'm heating up the back heating up the corners and now I got my white heated up I want kind of a big blob because he's only got one eye so it has to be kind of big right there in the center of his face <laughs> I don't know why that makes me giggle but it's funny okay there's his eyeball let's get a black here and give him his pupil now he can see now he has come to life and if you're a hairy scary monster you have no friends so that means you're not happy so i have a red stringer here it's kind of fat and i'm going to give him a grimace so just up and down Ooh, this one's thick. Just like that. Just a nice little W up and down grimace. Go ahead and press it down. Okay, guys, and that is your hairy, scary monster. Have a great weekend. I'll be back on Monday with a new silver video. Um, Take care. Bye.